Everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome to Keyboard Skills Pro. My name is Tom, and it's an enormous pleasure, as always, to have your company here for an evening of informal music. And um, been a bit of a busy week, um, lots going on. And um, of course, here in the UK, we have uh, last week had our schools return um, as the kind of first major step of easing the UK uh, lockdown. So, um, uh, but uh, but tonight is just a bit of fun. Um, and uh, we're just going to be playing the keyboard and exploring some of the many tunes that you often find 
inside one of these busker books and uh, these books have been around for absolutely donkey's years um, they have been around uh, way longer than me and in fact many of them are not printed now there are a small selection printed but they were basically normally about a hundred songs or in this case 101 um, and they were always in these very small little easy to carry books and they're really nice because they were just simple melodies right hand chord symbols, guitar chord symbols, but very good if you just needed a very simple version of a tune without all the bass clef and all the, the things. So that's what we're doing tonight, just a bit of fun. Um, I've actually got a giant busker's book here which has a 1001 tunes in, would you believe? And we're playing uh, my keyboard and just having a bit of fun, um, randomly choosing songs. So if I see one that I don't know, I'll play it. Uh, if I see one that I like, I might play it. If I've seen one that I've played before, well, who knows? Anyway, let's just say a quick... Um, Pardon me while I just bend down here. Um, ooh, how do you do, madam? Um, <laughs> on the list, uh, just a few folks to say hello to. We've got Ernie in Iowa. Hello, Ernie. Welcome from uh, from the US there. Uh, Trevor's on. Hello, Trevor Bunce. Uh, ben Fuller's on. Hello, Ben. Um, Steve's on up in Scotland. Um, Steve, it's very cold and wet down here today. I'm, I'm, hopefully, it's a bit sunnier in Scotland. Uh, my family is on. Uh, mother, father, and uh, sister Rebecca, classic Cara. Wedding hi, hello, um, Edward Wilding, very good evening to you Edward, Tom McCauley in uh, Melton Mowbray, of course that's where my family is for, from Leicestershire, my dad uh, uh, was um, born and raised near Melton Mowbray and uh, mum's side of the family from Leicester itself, so uh, big ties to the area there, and um, uh, Janae's put, good evening Tom, how has your day been? It's been okay Janae, it's been very busy, I've been at school today um, uh, as a lot of my work is I do a lot of teaching, as a lot of you know, and uh, I teach one day a week at a private Norfolk boarding school uh, where I teach mostly piano, but we do a bit of organ as well. So I've been uh, teaching um, the youngsters there today. Uh, Keith's on. Hello, Keith. Welcome. Um, and oh, and uh, who have we got? Eddie and Trevor having a chat. That's nice. Uh, Alan from Leeds. Good evening, Tom. Hope you're well, Alan. Hello, Peter. Welcome, Peter. Um, um, <laughs> JF has put, oh God, that smile to camera had me cracking up. Hey, we've got a smile at the camera, haven't we? Um, and um, and Dulcian32 said, what well, if it isn't the lad that is Tom Horton? It is I, Dulcian, absolutely. Um, oh, Harold's on. Hello. Good evening from Bavaria. Could anyone explain to me what busking is or what busker means? Yeah, that's, that's an interesting term. Well, to busk is basically an old term where um, a musician goes out um, on the streets um, with a guitar, puts his case out and plays and people throw money in. And that's what busking is. You are a busker um, um, or people might uh, play the accordion or sing or whatever. You see them in London and different towns, often sometimes in my town, you see a guy in the thoroughfare. So that's what that is, Harold. Um, and uh, yeah, as Dolcian says, a non climature of busking is playing on the street. Um, Gary, hello Gary from Los Angeles. Tom... Um, Tom McCauley says that, and Trevor's answered the question, and Harold says thanks. Um, Sam Johnson, hello Sam, evening Tom, already a fan of the song. Right? Sam is actually along with Steve and one or two other folks like Trevor and the gang there, um, patrons of mine on patreon.com, and um, Sam is actually, um, um, I think Sam's either a gold or a platinum supporter, and so Sam actually gets to ask me specific video topics that I feature on my channel. So if like uh, Sam and the rest of the game, if you'd like to support what I do um, by you know, helping me invest in lights and cameras and things, you can do that by a monthly, um, a monthly pledge. It's like a musician's tip jar, and it starts from just one pound a month, and uh, if you sign up for that, you support the channel, but then the higher tiers, you can get bonus PDFs, bonus videos, exclusive content, it's not available anywhere else on YouTube, and uh, uh, the higher tiers, gold and silver, you can even request specific videos and get free gifts as well. So please do check out patreon.com forward slash keyboard skills pro. Um, so that's all good fun. Uh, Richard Baldwin, hello Richard. Hi there, Colin, good evening Colin. Um, and um, Richard is from Atlanta, Georgia. Well, welcome to you all everybody. And as I say, not too much um, talking tonight. We're just basically gonna be playing on my keyboard because um, um, it was the thing that was plugged into the mixer from my teaching the other day. Um, and I say, it has been a bit of a, a long few weeks. Um, um, I, I don't know about you, but the lockdown now is getting very tiring. Um, but uh, we're, we're trying to, uh, you know, maintain the light at the end of the tunnel. And of course, at the end of this month, we are going to be looking forward to some slight lightening of the, um, the rules here in England, where we can meet with, I think it's the, the rule of six comes back in, and we can meet with 
two different households so we get to see you know grandma and granddads again and and uh, meet in the garden hopefully the weather's a bit weather and then of course on april the 12th um fingers crossed all non-essential retail open so the shops will start to open again hairdressers i need a haircut as you can see <laughs> so anyway folks we started off there with american patrol and then we had um at the hop and that was because simply because it was at the beginning of the, the book. So there's loads of songs, as you can see in this book, absolutely tons of them. And they're all laid out with um, chord symbols. They're all laid out with melody lines. So very simple arrangements, but they're just nice to play. So I'm just going to sit here and just uh, go through the book and uh, see what, um, what comes up. There's loads of weird ones, lots of songs that we haven't heard before. So we'll see what we can come up with and play some nice ones. Here's a nice one, Bring Him Home. This is from Les Miserables. So anyway, everybody, we'll come back and have a chat in a while, but for the next sort of half an hour or so, just uh, enjoy the music, and thanks so much for spending um, your time here. Oh, hello, Steve. Steve's on. Yeah, Sam Johnson is on Platinum. Platinum member. Well done, Sam. Um, oh, Reverend Tony. Hello, Tony from Rugby, and welcome to Steve and Pat in, uh, in Cambridge. There. So enjoy, everybody. Thanks so much. See you in a minute.
There we are, everybody. I <laughs> got a bit carried away there. It's amazing, isn't it? You sit and play the organ, the keyboard, or the piano, and the time and all your worries just melts away. And uh, I, for one, feel a lot better after that. It beats any workout at the gym. Um, I've been reading your lovely comments as I've been playing. Um, you're all extremely kind. Um, <clears throat> and um, uh, thank you very much for all your lovely words. It's really, really lovely to... To read them um, really is nice and uh, Gary's put uh, been on lockdown here since January of 2020 so I feel you hope you get your vaccine soon well the vaccines now are starting to get into um, I think the sort of the late 
40s, 50s age bracket. So um, I'm expecting mine sort of any day now. But I know a lot of people have had theirs, um, which is all good news. Sam's book, brilliant version of The Entertainer. Thank you, Sam. Um, bit of fun there. Not all the keys on the keyboard, of course, so the piano. Uh, Tom's book, I'm enjoying the show so far. Well, I hope, Tom, after you type that, you still <laughs> enjoyed the show. Um, which is nice to hear. Um, who have we got, uh, which is good. Oh, Frankie's on. Hello, Frankie. Uh, welcome, um, uh, Alla, Eddie Fowler's put. Oh, hello, Eddie. Uh, recent uh, joining me on Patreon. Thank you, Eddie, for joining me on Patreon.com. Uh, Maurice Albert earlier, and now the Hollies. That's right. Um, Alan said, "Great show." Thanks very much, Alan. Keith, hello, Keith. Um, also on Patreon as well. Super musical evening, Tom. Clap, clap. <laughs> Harold's put in Germany. I got the impression you're playing. Much more than, than what's written on the book. Well, actually, that's that's very true, Howard. You probably you folks probably noticed a few extra notes thrown in there. But you see, the great thing with these buskers books, and you, you can pick these up in your local music shop. So um, you can pick them off off the internet. There's lots of second-hand ones around as well. But but it is literally just a just a single line and a chord symbol. So they're, it, they're I find they're really good places to start, particularly when you're doing a, a concert piece because. Um, it's um, it's not too over influencing. You just got the chords, the melodies, a very basic song structure, and then you can sort of, as I've been doing, just mess around, trying ideas on the fly, and then you you hopefully find something nice. So think about. Um, I was playing with you for the last 35 minutes or something, says Dulcian32. I think that's John. Is it John? I think it is. Um, it was very useful as the rhythm tempo and everything changed so quickly. My head needed to make quick decisions and deductions. Well, there you go. Sounds good. Janae's put lovely music while I was writing my new story. Oh, Janae, that sounds exciting. Very exciting. Um, uh, oh, my family's put brilliant variety and selection. Enjoyed it. And Craig Gallagher has put great playing and setting up the next track brilliant thanks oh thank you very much Craig. well thank you to all of you for watching really appreciate it um and don't forget folks if you're in a generous frame of mind and fancy adding something got to get the advert in now um to your music collection um, at home, we have a huge library of things on the website. And if you don't know anything about me or think, who is this Tom Horton guy? He doesn't look trustworthy. Um, you can check out my website, tomhorton.co.uk, uh, where you'll be able to read about my musical sort of career to date, things that I do. Um, there's links to YouTube videos, links to Patreon, but there's also lots of music CDs. Um, so we've got Strike Up the Band on a Wurlitzer. We've got Hey There, I'm recorded on Lowry. There's also um, it's Magic, that's recorded on Larry, and there's a couple of Yamaha organ CDs from yesteryear. You can also treat yourself to my new organ book, Theatre Organ Originals. And indeed, if you're in a piano mood, there are three wonderful piano books from the Pianistic series, all available to order on the website, and you, I can send those all over the world. So hopefully you might treat yourself to one of those. But if you're enjoying the channel, please do visit patreon.com um, forward slash keyboard skills pro. And that will be absolutely lovely if you uh, might consider um, investing in what I do because obviously all this stuff does take a lot of money and investment and everything that I get off Patreon is driven back in. So we've got a new MacBook computer, we've got new mixers, new video cameras. It's all trying to make the sound and the vision, um, not just for the live streams better, um, but also for um, uh, the general videos as well. So don't forget folks, every Tuesday fortnight we have a two minute tip, a little musical tidbit video on the channel every Wednesday um, fortnight we have a live stream and we're going to keep doing these even when the lockdown is over and uh, we've got some fun ideas coming some different uh, things and tonight was just a uh, basically I'll, I'll be quite honest with you I completely <laughs> ran out of time and I thought to myself ah oh, it's brilliant I thought I've got another week before the next live stream loads of time to plan it and then realized oh balls it's tomorrow so I thought what can I do ever organize as the professional and um, so um, I thought, you know, let's just sit and play like we all do. You know, I, I, I do it as a career and I do lots of different things in my career. Work with Alan's music, with all the wonderful organs. Um, and uh, actually, at, at Alan's, this is actually my 20th year being part of the gang there. Um, 20 years this August, which is quite amazing. And some of the organs that we've seen over those years, my goodness me. But um, organs are very popular at the moment and lots of exciting verses and um, ringways and and the Lowry, second and Lowry's are still very popular. So any of you ever thinking about upgrading your organ or a new keyboard or a piano, do check out Alan's Music Centre, based in the east of England, deliver all over the country, and I'm very proud to be part of the team there. Um, and you can also see um, myself with Trevor and Lucy at Allen's on the Hobby Organist, 
um, uh, which is, um, sorry, Lowry UK, I should say, YouTube channel. Every Monday, uh, Trevor and I do a little Monday morning Q&A, and it's nice to see different organs and learn things. And then Lowry owners get a, a fun thing on Friday afternoons with Lucy and Trevor, so do watch out for that. Um, but in the meantime, thank you so much for watching, everyone. Thanks for giving up your evening. I've had a great time. I need to go inside now and get ready for lessons tomorrow, because we've got a um, sort of seven, eight hours of lessons tomorrow. And um, uh, yeah, it's great fun. So, but hopefully soon, that later this year, we'll be back at the cinema in Southwall playing the organ there for the the visitors. Um, hopefully, uh, I spoke to Jonathan Ling um, the other day, my friend Jonathan, who runs the Grange collection. Uh, we're hoping maybe later in the year we might be able to open the collection because um, I'm uh, dying to go and try his brand new Wurlitzer, which he's just acquired, a lovely 1937 three keyboard word so which we're looking forward to playing for the public and also next year we'll be doing pantomimes in january and um so all those things hopefully will come back very soon a few uh, cheerios uh, to go and um, we've got oh, keith and susan from essex hello keith a uh, patron and student of mine um sounds well these are all classic tunes i really enjoy your arrangements on just about everything you play it's really inspired to hear another take yes yeah, it's, it's, it's interesting when you play songs folks don't just stick the book up and go oh it says country so i'll press country um like um on the slow boat to china there that was on like a sort of a modern um, um sort of a modern um pop dance ballad i think what did, what did we do that on we did that on mellow hip hop so you know if you've got like a, a yamaha or a verzi you can probably find some of these modern styles and they'd be very very nice um oh um craig's put tom how often do you use the circle of fifths poster or is that just for decorations craig that is the bible as far as i'm concerned the, the circle of fifths um maybe actually we'll do a um, a q and a next time a musical Q&A. So two weeks time, let's do that. We'll do a musical question and answer session. So all you organ, keyboard and piano players, any questions on your playing, styles, chords, circle of fifths, let's do a, an hour Q&A music session and we'll give you some hints and tips and I'll try and answer your questions live, uh, live on air. But Craig, that is very useful because it explains all the things like chords, intros, endings, keys, scales, and I really do plumb that into my students because it's a very strong foundation of what we do. Alan said, thanks Tom, great concert tonight. Thank you to everybody for watching. And um, let's finish off with something in the book. I have no idea what. Um, <laughs> so, oh, here we go, Take the A Train. There we go, we'll finish with Take the A Train. A bit of big band, one of my favourite styles to take us out. And so, yeah, once again, everybody, thank you so, so much for um, for watching. Do take care of yourselves, um, stay safe, keep, um, keep wearing the masks and everything, and good luck with those of you who are going to have your vaccination. Those of you who had yours, hope that's all gone well, and we'll see you very soon in a couple of weeks. But in the meantime, folks, do send us an email from time to time via the website, and uh, thank you so much to all of you for your company this evening. I will say cheerio, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.